Hey guys, Jessie here, back with your Locker Talk. Um, this weekend we're travelling to Melbourne, so this week we're going to talk about travel. So let's go talk to some of the girls. What would be your favourite holiday destination? Um, probably I've always wanted to go to Iceland, but I've never been, so yeah. Iceland. The States. I've been there like three times now and there's still so much I haven't seen, so yeah. I'd probably say Lake Tahoe over in the States. I love Fiji, but I want to go to Japan. Um, now I think you'd be a good one for this. What's your favourite travel song? Ooh, travel song. Um, well I've got a whole travel like road trip playlist, so um, good sing-along one. Oh, a good sing-along. I do love Dog Days by Florence. It's like my ultimate number one song, so I usually just put it in any music questions. So, yeah, probably a bit of Florence and the Machine. Nice. Can you give us a demo at all? <coughs> um, <laughs> nah, not really. She can hit pretty high notes, and um, as we've all seen from my Celine Dion fiascos. <laughs> Wherever you are, you are here in my heart. My heart will go on and on. I do tend to like struggle a little bit on those high ones, and um, and yeah, so it's more of a, a clap along on the steering wheel, I reckon. <laughs> uh, life, life is a highway, Rascal Flats version, yeah. Depends where I go. Like when I go back home, I listen to country because like it's a bit of country. But like when you're hooning around here, it's a bit like... <laughs> Can't listen to that stuff around here. Yeah. I'd say anything from growing up, so it'd be a bit of a mixture of playlist. Yeah. Bit of Linkin Park, Spice Girls, Eminem, oh, Spice Girls. Safe Tonight by Eagle Eye Cherry. Yeah, never heard of that one, but Spice Girls, we'll, we'll go with that. If we were to go, sorry, on a road trip around Australia, who in the team would you take and who would you definitely not take? I reckon I'd go with Natty Exxon. Um, we've kind of been planning a little bit of a holiday recently and she threw out the idea of a road trip. So, um, yeah, I reckon Natty would be great to road trip with because she's done a lot of driving, so I could probably just sit in the passenger seat and chill out with Nacho and she'd have Hugo as well, so that would be awesome. Who would I not take? Um, oh, probably Ruby Blair, I reckon. Uh, probably Sophie Conway. Yeah. yeah. That's just because she's standing listening, isn't it? Nah, nah, she brings some good banner and half decent tunes. Oh, isn't that lovely? <laughs> so then the question is, who would you not bring Paige Parker, 100%? <laughs> I'd definitely not bring um, Sophie. <laughs> Why is that? Oh, she's just... just Sophie. Oh, really? She's just... Um... <laughs> Oh, nah, yeah, yeah. Nah, yeah, nah, yeah. I'm kind of like driving by myself, so I'd just go by myself. I'd take Lutzi with me. She's very resourceful. <laughs> Shani. <laughs> I, wouldn't, I wouldn't take Gabby Collingwood because there's just too much Taylor Swift. It would be, it would be just overdone. I wouldn't handle it. If you were on a deserted island, private island, um, you could pick anyone in the world who would be with you. What's that? Oh, what's that festival called that was on that island? Oh, fire. Yes. So fire style. Um, who would I take to fire? Is that what the question is? Or anyone what? In the world. Anyone in the world. What would I take, or who would I take to fire? Who? Taylor Swift. So that there's actually some musical talent at fire. <laughs> Maybe like, who's that guy in Indiana Jones? I feel like he could just do everything for me. Yeah. I, def I was gonna say my mum, but I'd get sick of her. <laughs> Sorry, Mum. You take like Bear Grylls, he'll like make you survive like the whole time. Yeah, but Indiana Jones is like way more like just cool. Yeah. yeah. No. I've seen my partner be a bit cheesy there. Aww. Yep. That's nice. No one has said that yet. Actually, that's kind of weird that no one said that yet. <laughs> Bear Grylls. That's what I said. Smart. You'd survive, right? <laughs>